What I'm going to go through today is the basic unpacking of the Z-Cat when you get it at your location. Now, you may get it in a cardboard box. That's how it comes standard with the same foam you're going to see. Uh, there's also an optional Pelican case, which is really great for uh, transporting the Z-Cat uh, to other locations, whether it's on an airplane or even shipping, if you're going to be doing that multiple times. It's uh, well worth the investment. So it can come with this optional Pelican case. When you open it up, you'll see We've got uh, laser cut foam inserts. Um, everything you see here comes with the, the Z-Cat. This is equipped with the, uh, the optional MK4 software. So we do have a, a quick start guide, which gives you a little bit of guidance and uh, information on the gauge. I'll just kind of set this aside. Um, one of the keys to the Z-Cat is, well, it is a precision tool. It's very robust for shop conditions, but we also want to be careful in handling it. It is portable, therefore, pretty much anybody can pick it up and move it around. Um, there is a handle on the top, which is good for lifting it. There's also two beams on the side, which are very handy for lifting it. However, you never want to lift it by the cross arms, uh, which is uh, part of the, the, the measurement system. So I'm going to grab this because of the location I'm in, I'm going to grab by these two beams just underneath and I can lift it up and I can just support it. Like I said, it weighs 30 pounds. I'm going to set it on my table. That's how easy it is to take out. Uh, there were the buttons that are on the side that always, when it's in the packaging, is, is uh, on the upward position. But, but the Z-Cat is now in, in, in position and the, the first thing we want to do is take out uh, this little packing piece which allows the Z-Cat to hold it in a, in a certain location, the, the, the arms. I'll put that back in here. We also have the AC adapter. Every Z-Cat comes with that. Um, every Z-Cat comes with an Ethernet cable. Um, the uh, Z-Cat has a standard Ethernet connection. Uh, we do have optional Wi-Fi connection. If you do have a Wi-Fi unit, you'll notice on the side, there's a, in this case, there's a little hole. That's where the antenna for the Wi-Fi would come out. But uh, this is an Ethernet version. This is the uh, MK4 software. If they've ordered the optional software, that will be there. There is a, uh, a test piece, which not only is a test piece, but doubles as a calibration standard. There's a sphere that threads right into the only threaded hole on here, so you'll see that pretty easily. Um, it comes with a standard Renishaw TP20 touch probe. I'll set that here for now. There's a little metal case here that will hold the, uh, it says right on the top there's an SD card adapter a Z-Cat wedge software, so every gauge comes with that as well. So you might ask what that SD card adapter for is for. Um, if there ever is an upgrade in the Z-Cat, we can send it to you via email. You can download it onto an SD card, which is in the top of the Z-Cat. A lot of people don't have a, an adapter, so we include that. Uh, you can download that onto there and we can install new software because the Z-Cat does have free software upgrades for the life of the machine. Every Z-Cat does come with a Z-Cat wedge software, so it's just on a, a memory stick. So that's something to load on your PC. Uh, this is the key or the dongle for the MK4 software. Since we do have that, I'll set that here as well. So that's everything that's in the case. Um, so this is a reusable case, whether you get the cardboard box or the Pelican case, obviously that's reusable. But the cardboard box has the same exact foam inserts in it. Uh, it can be reusable. Do not throw it away. You'll need it to ship it back for calibration or if there's ever service needed. Now let's talk about what we do with the Z-Cat after it's out of the box. So um, obviously the first thing we need to do is put the touch probe on. So again, it's a standard Renishaw TP20 touch probe. There's a few other 
things that come with it. I'll leave those in there for now. There's not going to be anything that we need to do. Um, it is magnetic, so it's uh, very easy. Now, it comes installed with two stylus, uh, a horizontal and a vertical stylus. Um, and if you look closely, you may or may not be familiar with these, but uh, there's a triangle, there's a square, and there's a sphere on here. And those will actually coincide exactly with a triangle, a square, and a sphere on the holder and it will magnetically just go on and as soon as it clicks in place, you're ready to go. Thank you.